Hey guys, so today I have another cloth diaper review for you. Today we're going to be talking about the Bungie's Diaper Subscription Program, which is super exciting. I love me some cloth diaper subscriptions, let me say right off the bat. So they do have three different options for their subscription services. You can get a print diaper with a solid diaper, so two diapers plus their inserts for $29.99. You can get the print diaper plus the insert plus a matching wet bag for $24.99, or you can get just the print diaper with the inserts for $19.99 a month. Now I am super glad that they have different subscription options so you can choose what's best for you, but I would honestly love to see just a pocket diaper option where you don't get any inserts inside because you guys know that I love to stuff my pockets with flats anyway and that's mostly what I use anyway so I think that would be super cool. So right off the bat I just want to let you know I did buy the Bungie subscription service in January when I was still pregnant with baby Barrett and I tried it out just for the one month and then a few months later they reached out to me and started sending me some diapers for free. So just FYI I have bought a couple but I've also been sent a bunch too so just so you know just full disclosure but all of my opinions are always 100% my own and honest these are my real thoughts about these diapers so it's a monthly subscription service and they always have like seasonal themed prints this is October's it has adorable little ghosts all over it I mean first of all let me say uh, it is very difficult. I tried to sit down and think of my favorite Bungie's diapers that I have gotten and it's really hard to choose a favorite print because they're just so stinking cute. Now let me show you what this diaper looks like up close so we can see all of its features. First of all, here are the two inserts that come inside. You have one that's a little bit smaller and one that's a little bit bigger and they do snap together and then you can take this whole thing and snap it into the front side of the inside pocket so you can snap it right there so it's all attached and then you can either stuff these inside so you have them like extra secure inside of your pocket or you can just leave them out whatever it is you want to do so it kind of gives you some options to use it as like an all-in-two type system or as a pocket system so inside we do have a fleecy stay dry layer in here we have a tummy panel which is awesome i love that i've learned to really appreciate tummy panels this time around with baby barrett it is a double open-ended pocket so you can stick it through either side so if there's a poo situation back here and it's just super duper gross and you don't want to touch it you can just pull it out from this side very very nice <laughs> you have the single leg gussets here on the leg section you have elastic on the butt side the back side of the diaper you have a little flap inside here to kind of cover up but the thing I like about that flap is that it's not like it's super flappy you know so when it's time to spray out a poopy diaper you're not getting poo like stuck in here that's something that really bugs me when the back flap is just too stiff or not movable enough so the front side does have that tummy panel and it's just straight across there's no elastic here on the belly side of the diaper I actually really do like this is the snap where you snap in your insert but just having that center snap right there helps you know where the center of the diaper is because sometimes you know when baby's growing so much they just like are you're always adjusting it's nice to know where the center of the diaper is just to give yourself a nice idea easily I know it's a silly little thing but I actually like it so as far as the snaps are concerned you can see they have two vertical snaps as well as a little hip snap here to help prevent any wing droop when it's on a moving little baby it also has crossover snaps which I super love you guys know that that's one of the things that I love about diapers <laughs> the fact that you can take a poopy diaper roll it up and snap it shut until you get home like if you're out of the house with it you can just deal with it when you get home and it's all secured together that's what I like crossover snaps for so the inserts are both natural fiber inserts I did do an absorbency test on them and I got one and a quarter cups of water poured on them before they started to leak off which is a very standard amount of absorbency if you ask me I would prefer it to have a little bit more absorbency I like my diapers to have more like a cup and a half to a cup and three quarters of absorbency but it totally passes the test for my like bare minimum I really like to have an insert that has at least a cup and a quarter because that's what I consider a standard amount of 
absorbency. That's what you can get out of a bird's eye, one size flat diaper most of the time. Now one thing that does kind of bug me about the inserts is that they're totally different sizes, and they're totally different sizes from the get-go. It's not like they've been washed a million times and one shrunk a bunch and the other one didn't. They're, they're intentionally one is smaller than the other one. So of course if you ask me, I think natural fibers are the way to go. You want to use stuff like bamboo, cotton, and hemp because microfiber, polyester, you know, artificial synthetic fibers tend to have issues in the long term, but natural fibers are always great. I did want to show you guys how small this diaper gets on its very smallest setting because it actually fit my baby Barrett after he lost his umbilical stump. So of course most one size diapers are not going to fit a new newborn who still has their umbilical stump because it's going to be higher on the belly and it's going to cover up the umbilical stump and that's not always a great thing. You want the umbilical stump to kind of dry out so that it falls off. So anyway, once the umbilical stump was gone for our baby Barrett, he was actually able to wear this little diaper which is really exciting. The leg holes were perfect little size on him and he was born at 7 pounds 7 ounces and he lost his umbilical stump at like two weeks old-ish, so he was probably about the same weight that he was when he was born, because he lost some weight and then he gained it back, you know how it goes. But anyway, the leg holes were perfect little size for him, and because it has a crossover snap, you can even get it tinier in the waist. Like, this is kind of big in the waist, so let me, let me show you what it looks like when you actually use the crossover here. So there you go, a nice little newborn size waist there, nice little tiny sized leg holes here. Let me move it out of the way. <laughs> little leg holes there, a nice little waist, and like I said, it worked on Baby Barrett, a very average sized little newborn. Now, one thing that I thought bugged me at first is that they show you the diaper like on Instagram before you even get your diaper. And I was like, man, I wish that it was a surprise. I wish you didn't know what the print was gonna be for the month and then you just got it and you were surprised when you got your mail, right? But as I thought about it, it kind of is a better option to know what the print is going to be for that month because then you can change your subscription options. So you can go in, as long as you do it in like the first half of the month, you can change your subscription options. So if you see this print, because they'll show you like the month before, if you see this print and you're like, oh my gosh, this is the cutest thing ever, I want it in the diaper and in the wet bag, you can change up your subscription. Or if you see a print and you're like, ah, I don't really like that so much, you're not going to want to get it in the wet bag too. You can also pause your subscription subscriptions and, and cancel your subscriptions, you know, all that kind of stuff. So you can go in and change it every month if you really like it or if you like it less. <laughs> so yeah, I, at first I was like, man, I'd really like to just get a surprise, which I do like getting surprise mail, you know, everybody does. But at the same time, I'm like, maybe it is better that you know what it is because they show you what it is like the month before. Oh, there is one thing I wanted to mention. Um, the diapers used to have a an internal leg gusset in here well I guess you wouldn't call it like a leg gusset it's just like an internal gusset in here where you have like this channel for the pee or the newborn poo to stay inside the diaper they do not have that anymore for the time being they may be able to bring it back we'll have to see but they had to change it up a little bit because of patent issues but yeah so the diapers used to like this is September's diaper it used to have that little internal gusset there but now it's just flat across that doesn't bother me I didn't really I mean I don't know I mean it might be good for like the newborn poo days but once baby starts eating solids and stuff like I don't think it's really necessary to have this little channel here however um, my sister has also tried out some of these diapers and she said she really liked the internal gusset so just so you know for the time being they're not doing the internal gusset right now and this is October that I'm filming this video okay in case you wanted to see it a little bit closer this was september's look how freaking adorable it is it's just super duper cute i love it but also like the ghosties oh my gosh and they also had maybe i'll show some pictures or a little bit of a video but they had one that was like a sea theme that was so gorgeous i also loved their fourth of july diaper this year for july um they just have so many adorable prints i will say that like i've been so happy with the prints and they're one of those companies where you see the print online on instagram and you're like oh that's adorable but once you get it in person it is just like so much more precious i can't explain it <laughs> 
So I do enjoy these diapers. You guys know that I like to stuff my pockets with flats anyway, so the absorbency isn't like as much as I would like it to be, but honestly, it's really nice if you just have some bird's eye flats that you like to use and maybe baby's out peeing those, just adding in one of these with your flat inside the diaper works totally awesome. I love stuffing pockets with flats. You guys know I love flat diapers anyway. <laughs> And of course the subscription is just so much fun. I love subscription services in general, but to have a cloth diaper subscription service is just, <laughs> it's just precious, it's awesome. So if you guys are interested in that kind of thing, I would totally recommend going and checking out Bungie's if you guys want to see the cute adorable prints. Sometimes they have leftovers of the previous months, so you can go check those out as well and you can buy those kind of separately from the subscription. So yeah, like I said at the beginning, I have bought some of the Bungie's that I own and I've been sent some of them as well so just full disclosure but all of my opinions are always 100% my own and honest you can actually use my coupon code it's just Lena's life and you can save 10% if you want to do that but yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this video I hope it was at least a little bit helpful and informative for you and I will talk to you guys next time bye